Another thing that I want to say about this new season of starting over and fresh starts for a lot of people is that there is going to be a stripping away. And I know that sounds extremely harsh, but just understand and walk with me as I, I express to you what that means. So I want to tell you a little bit about what has been happening this year. For me, when I turned 37 at the beginning of the year, I realized that for whatever reason I've been saying this since it happened, I feel like this is the second half of my life. I don't know if I'm gonna check out of here at 74, y'all, I don't know. But I just know that for whatever reason, this feels like the second half of my life. One thing that I wanna share with you guys as well is that I've been in the book of Job again. If you've been on this journey with me from the very beginning, I share with you guys that that was the book that I read when I first started to um, come back basically to Christ and come back into alignment with God for my life. I started reading the book of Job at 31, and I realized within reading the book of Job that there was a true stripping away. Job was stripped of his resources, he was stripped of his family, he was stripped of his health. So many things were taken away from him which seemed like it happened overnight. Stripping away, I realized something and God allowed me to see this, which is very, very interesting in a full circle moment. Because like I said, when I started my journey, I remember reading that book and seeing how many things were taken away from him. And I realized that for me at that time, what correlated was his health because I was going through a lot of health issues. What I realized is that in the book of Job in chapter 42, verse 12, I believe Job's life is restored. Everything is restored for him twice as much as before. But here's the thing, and I thought this was extremely divine. It said in that same verse, that it was restored in the second half of his life. And I was like, cause I've been saying this from the beginning of the year. And I was just like, okay, that's interesting. I'm going to definitely journal that and remember that. And I thank you God for that, that beautiful revelation. And thank you also for confirming it in your word.